Hello everyone, it's Westrom here, back with another video, and in today's vid, we are going to be reacting to the new Big Paintball update. Now, here I am on the game's page, and one thing I want to point out is the title of the game. It says, Nuketown, in all capital letters. Now, if anyone here in my comment section, or watching this video, has ever played Call of Duty, you may understand why I'm kind of happy about this. Now, I'm not saying this is the actual Nuketown map, I'm simply saying, what if it is the Nuketown map from Call of Duty? That would be insane. And it does say it's a new team deathmatch mode, so I don't know if you can play it in free fall or anything. I think it's only going to be team deathmatch. So anyway, if you're excited for this, make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, guys, turn on those notifications and comment down below if you guys want me to make more big paintball videos. But without further ado, let's go ahead and hop right into it. Okay, everyone, so I just joined the game. There's only 25 seconds left, and sadly... We did get into Nuketown, which kind of sucks. So it is the Nuketown from Call of Duty, which is awesome. I just can't believe I got in so late. That really is so sad. Why did I have to get in with only 10 seconds left? We might get the same map again. Who knows? But let's just wait and see. So it looks like Nuketown's not even an option. So we're going to have to leave this game and rejoin a new one. Okay, so this round only has about 40 seconds left. I swear I've rejoined about 10 different servers to find a game that could potentially get Nuketown. And this is the closest. So we have about 30 seconds until this round is over. I didn't even join the game. I'm simply waiting to play this new map. And I guess while we're waiting for that, I'll show you guys on Call of Duty. This is the map Nuketown. So it's really cool. I think it's one of their best maps they've ever made. And I think a lot of people would agree with me. This is it. And basically, they recreated it in Big Paintball. And oh my god, I still did not get it. How unlucky can I be? Okay, guys. So we finally got it. There's 8 minutes and 30 seconds left. So I'm going to probably go AK for this map. The sniper is not really that good for it. And... Somehow I just leveled up by doing nothing. But anyway, let's go ahead and try this thing out. Okay, so here we are on the map. You guys can see it is very similar to the actual COD map that we all know and love. Oh my goodness, <laughs> there's a guy just camping on top of our spawn. What the heck? So he is literally right up here. I don't know how we're going to be able to take him out, but your boy's got to try, right? Like, what are you supposed to do? So... This map could use a little bit of help. I don't think you can take out the guy up here. It's gonna be physically impossible. Like, what is that? How are you supposed to kill this guy when he's surrounded by turrets? It's physically impossible. How am I supposed to take him out? So, they really do need to think about this a tiny bit more. Okay, we got him. We still need to take out his sentry, though. I don't think we're gonna be able to. So, let's push out towards more the middle of the map. And yeah, it's literally a recreation of Nuketown. I mean, there is a bit more different to this map instead of the other. Like, for instance, there's a lot more, like, of these cargo crates out here instead of actual cars. But I don't think that matters too much. It still looks really nice. Yeah, this spawn is so bad. Honestly, like, they're never going to be able to get out if we have just so many people sitting here camping them ready to shoot them. Like, look at this. How is that fair? Especially the fact you can, like, put a sentry on top of this thing, and then they can't, like, do anything. It's crazy. Oh, well, he got around me. That's pretty smart. Okay, I'm gonna try and run back over. I just know there's gonna be some guy at our spawn camping around, you know, trying his best not to get shot, which will be kind of annoying. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. Wow. But I think we've got eight tags, and I've been tagged two or three times, so not that good of a ratio for myself, but... Right there, we got two tags. There's a sentry right there we need to get rid of. There we go. Maybe if I set a sentry, like, right here, that would be annoying. Got him. Got him. Maybe a drone and a radar to find out where these people are. So there's someone there. Someone there. There's another guy here. Okay, we got him. Maybe a sentry right there as they turn. That is an annoying sentry. Wow. Oh, a guy right up here. There's a person here. Oh my goodness, okay. Megalodon is pretty good at this game, I do have to admit. So, let's use another radar after we get a bit closer. Wait, can you... You can't destroy these windows, that's a big rip. Oh well. It's okay, guys, we can jump maybe on top of these boxes. Ooh, this is a good vantage point. But again, you will probably get shot by a bunch of people trying to stay up here. Because you're pretty much exposing yourself to the entire server. What? Oh my god! We just took so many of them out. Okay, I'm gonna run this way. Pull out my drone. Put a sentry, like, right here. We should be able to catch this person off guard. Yep. Oh, we didn't even hit him. That was my drone, I think. Wow, okay. 
We're still doing pretty good. Oh my god. They got two sentries just sitting over there. I took them both out. That's good. There's two people right here. Uh, I'm going to use another radar just to identify where people are. Put a sentry down. Yeah, people are going to get very annoyed by me. Oh my goodness. They literally can't do anything when you camp their spawn. It's crazy. Oh, Megalodon. It's always Megalodon, guys. So we have four minutes and 30 seconds left in this round. So I definitely did not join with 15 minutes, of course. But I'm still having a lot of fun. And I, I mean, we're getting close to the top. I already have 35 tags. And it's only been like four minutes, which is pretty good ratio right there. So let's try and get closer over here. I want to see if I can get a sentry really close over here and tag them whenever they pop out. Like right there, my sentry should have got them. Why is my sentry not getting Megalodon? There we go. So is anybody on top of this house? I used my radar. I don't see anyone up here. I'm assuming there could be a sentry. No. Okay, we got lucky. There's no one on top of the house anymore. So we're going to get back on top of these boxes. Use our radar so we can identify where people are at. There's still a guy up here. I don't know if we're going to be able to tag him. We should probably just push forward. Right there. What happened to my radar? I swear I used it, but I guess it didn't work. Okay, there's definitely someone here. Oh my goodness. Okay, he might tag me. Okay, we're lucky. We got really lucky right there. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Okay, I'm putting that down there. Hopefully the sentry will tag somebody as they try and walk through. Oh, he's just sitting behind spawn. Rip. I don't know if we're going to be able to tag him. Megalodon, come on. Oh, Megalodon's way too good at dodging and everything. He's so good. Let's use another radar. One more until we get another sentry. Right here. Come on. Yes. Okay, we're putting another sentry down right here. My goodness. This is so unfair. Uh-oh, wait. He can see me through the shield of their spawn. There we go. We got him. I'm going to use another radar. The guy right up there. Oh, that was Megalodon. Rip Megalodon, dude. He has been performing really good the past few times I've came in contact with him. There we go. Another sentry. Wow, I think we are just gonna take these guys out. Like, he can't do anything. What if we sit up here, too? Like, my drone can just sit here and shoot over the edge. That is so unfair. Like, what is that? And I can put a sentry right here. Oh, no, you can't. It was too close. Okay, we'll put one right there. As if they uh, walk up the steps, they'll just instantly get shot by a sentry. Come on, you're right there. Come on, peek out. I know you're here. My goodness, we are just taking everybody out. How is this even fair? A minute 30 left. I'm going to shoot right here. Another sentry. I'll just put it right there, I guess. And another radar. Got him. Oh my god, we have 73 tags. Holy. We are going insane. So I'd say there are a few issues with this map, starting with the fact you can literally spawn camp them way too good. It's not even fair to an extent. Like, they have to sit in their spawn to shoot me or else they're dead. And that's just speaking facts too. So we have a minute left. Uh, I don't think we're going to get a nuke this round. We'd have to get a tag every three seconds, but we could definitely finish this out round out strong. So let's try and tag every single person we possibly can. Let's use radar drone. Megalodon's down here. He's really good. Okay, so someone's right here. They're going to run towards here. Yep. We pulled up. Oh my goodness. There is a sentry right there. Okay, let's put one right here then. Oh, there's a sentry right here as well, isn't there? Yep. There's a person there. We have another sentry. I'll put it right here. Yeah, I feel really bad for their team right now. Okay, I'm about to get tagged. There's no way he doesn't. How did he not tag me? Are you kidding? We have 17 seconds left. I need 12 more tags for a nuke. So, don't think that's happening. But at least we got pretty close, right? I mean, we had 8 minutes on the map. And we already got almost 100 tags. So... I would say that's pretty good. I'll use my drone, my radar right here, sentry, everything I possibly can. 
And boom, we took first place with 91 tags. Wow, 30,000 credits, and I had a streak of 40 tags in a row. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. I personally love the new map. You'll probably see a lot more gameplay coming from me in the near future on Big Paintball. I'm also doing 1v1.lol and some Roblox VR on my second channel, so make sure you guys go check that out. Now, I generally don't promote my social medias that much in my videos, but I do recommend you go down below, check out my Discord, Twitter, my Twitter, Twitch, please check out everything because it would truly mean a lot to me. Anyway, that's enough from me. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.